Hi girls, today I want to share with you what's in my shower. So if you care to see what I have in my shower, just keep on watch. So first I'm going to start right here. Here I just have an empty Bath & Body Works uh, candle. And I put in it my scissors, my razor, my tooth comb, and like my foot scrub and stuff like this. Next here we have Kika's shampoos and conditioners. So these are her shampoos and this is my favorite for her. It's the Pet Head um, So Spoiled Conditioner. And yeah, I use conditioner for my dog, so don't judge me. And there at the end, there is like miniature uh, shampoos, conditioners, and body wash. Like when I have like small trips, I take this uh, small sizes. Next, I have this part, which is mainly Lush, and I really like Lush products. So first, I have it's a raining man, and this is a shower gel. And as you can see, I'm almost out of it. I love the smell, and I already have a backup. Next I have this solid shampoo, I'm not sure what is it called, but it's this uh, green one. And yeah, I really like it, it smells so good and it cleans my hair very well. Next I have Aqua Mirabilis and it's like a body scrub soap. And it's very very moisturizing, I really like it. And it looks like this. Next I have Buffy's also soap scrub and it looks like this. This is like softer than the Aqua Mirabilis one and I really like it. Moving on I have Ocean Salt. Um, it's a face and body scrub and it looks like this. I really like it but I usually use it for my body because it's very very harsh on my face. Next I have Sweet Pea and this is a shower jelly which I didn't use much because I don't know. But it smells so good and I love the way it, like it's jelly. So cool. Next I have Rose Argan uh, Body Conditioner and basically it's a conditioner for your body while you're like in the shower and it looks like this and it smells so good so after you use your like shower gel and you scrub and like this is the last thing you do and just keeps your body very very moisturized. Next I have this Lemony Flutter box but inside it I have my Alba what do you call this shaving cream because when I travel I don't like to take the full bottle so I keep it in here next I have retreat conditioner and I'm not a big fan it smells so good but I don't think it works very well next I have big shampoo which is a shampoo but I'm not a big fan of it I I don't know I tried it a couple of times but I don't really love it and last but not least I have Jasmine and Henna uh, conditioner which I used and I'm almost out of it but I really really don't like the smell it's so strong and it's so like floral so I'm not a big fan but I already used it also that's that moving on to this part which is mainly shower gels and some shaving cream so first I have three uh, Victoria's Secret body washes so first I have vanilla lace which smells like vanilla I have sheer love and it smells so good and the last one is Mango Temptation and I really like this one. And then I have three uh, Bath & Body Works. First I have Charmed Life and this is my recent one. And I have Wild Honey Suckle which smells so good. And the last one is Twisted Peppermint and it smells so Christmassy. Next I have this body wash from uh, Body Shop and this is called Midnight Bakula. Looks like this, it's very nice. I had this for like a year and a half or something and it smells so good but it's like a men's cologne and I really like it. My all time favorite shower gel is the Laura Mercier uh, Honey Bath in Creme Brulee and it smells like this and as you can see I didn't use much of it because I really really like it and I, I, I want to save it for like special occasions and stuff and it smells exactly like creme brulee back here I have shaving creams I have Vit which is, smells so bad I have a gelat one and I have a peach one and that's my favorite so moving to this part it's basically shampoos this is my recent one I got this from Italy and it's a clarifying shampoo I really like it but I just use it like once in a week here I have my husband's shampoo which is the brand hair of the dog I have no idea what's that and next I have this Kirstas shampoo and this is like my second or third bottle I really really like the kind Kirstas and next I have this Amir shampoo which I really really like I got this out of Outlook like really long time ago and I don't know if you can see I just have like one or two uses so I'm just saving this shampoo because I really like it 
I also have this L'Oreal shampoo and one of my new uh, purchases oops sorry <laughs> it's so wet is this um, Victoria's Secret Amber Romance shampoo and it smells so good and the last shampoo I have is the macadamia shampoo and I really like it and I have it upside down because I'm almost out of it I'm trying to like use each and every drop of it so I really like this one and I already have a backup moving to this part I keep all my conditioners so first I have this uh, soap and glory mini hair supply which is okay and then I have this Anasuya I guess it's called that it's a hair treatment which I really like next I have my all-time favorite which is a 10 uh, miracle hair mask and I love this Next I have my macadamia conditioner which looks like this, smells so good also. Then I have a L'Oreal conditioner which looks like that. Then I have a Kerastase conditioner which is the matching conditioner for the shampoo. Next I have this uh, Body Shop volumizing conditioner which I'm not a big fan of. And on the back here I have my all-time favorite mask hair mask which is the macadamia hair mask deep repair hair mask and I'm sure everyone and their mother used this because it's the best hair mask ever and I already have a lot of backups and I really really like this and last but not least I have this hair styler hair mask which is okay it's nothing really special and right there I have a mini piece of Lush uh, hand soap which is Honey I Wash the Kids, it's my favorite and it smells like heaven. So moving on, up there I have more shower gels. So first I have this uh, Clean Girl Body Wash by Soap and Glory which smells so good and I have this whole big bottle. Next I have this Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue Perfume Shower Gel and it smells so good. I have this Hello Kitty Shower Gel and it's uh, the scent is fruity. And I have this uh, like decorative, I don't really use it, shower gel. And it's like very sparkly and yeah, it's so girly. And I never used it because I, I like the way it looks. And here I have this Cara Marine Groove, which used to be one of, still one of my favorite perfumes, but it's so summery. And yeah, that's the shower gel for the matching perfume. And here I have my Clean and Clear Body Moisturizing Burst Body Wash and yeah, I'm almost out of it. Moving on to this part, more shower gels. These are like mini size uh, shower gels. I recently got this from Italy and I didn't try them yet. But this is uh, a strawberry, pomegranate, uh, vanilla and coconut. So that's that. Here I have like my uh, empty, almost empty uh, shower gel. This is a peppermint bark by Philosophy. This is my all-time favorite and I need to grab another one which is the Philosophy uh, Creme Brulee and as you can see I'm almost out of it. And I have another Philosophy um, shower gel and this is called Sweet On You and it smells like strawberries. I really like this also. Moving to this part, more shower gel. So I have Tone uh, Oatmeal and Shea Butter Body Wash. This is my husband's uh, body wash and this is the same brand like the shampoo but this is the body wash. I have my nose scrub by Soap and Glory and I use this all over my face not only my nose. I have my shaving cream which is the Alba um, what is that vanilla mango vanilla and it smells so good and here's another body wash um, that's my husband's and here I have a body shop like uh, exfoliating body wash and it smells so good this is strawberry and another exfoliating uh, body wash by Freeman and this is 2-in-1 exfoliating body wash blackberry and it smells so so good here I have my face scrub and this is the apricot scrub and last but not least I have a Lux Secret Bliss body wash which I got in a swap and I really like it so moving down I have some body scrubs so I have this Philosophy uh, Candy Cane body scrub I have another body scrub which I'm not sure where I got this from I have the Soap and Glory body scrub and I have one of the uh, 
Bath, not Bath and Body Works, the Body Shop Body Scrub in Mango. Then I have this uh, foot exfoliator, which is so good. I had one of these before, and this is like a new one. I didn't even open it. Next, I have three um, lip scrubs, for, uh, two from Lush. So this one is bubblegum, and it smells so good and tastes so good. And this one is Sweet Lips, and it's also a a lip scrub and this is also a lip scrub by sugar kiss I guess and it smells so good and tastes so good and the last part here I have this premier uh, Dead Sea uh, sea salt body scrub which is so good I have an Egyptian body scrub it's called Nefertari and it smells like mandarin it's so good that's one of my favorites and here I have my feminine intimate cleansing wash and here I have my um, exfoliating scrub which is a face scrub and it smells so good it smells like mint and this is by Biosphere and last but not least I have my purity cleanser which I use like in the shower to wash my face and stuff and last but not least down there we have all our loofahs so obviously these are mine the pink and the hot pink and the baby blue and the black are my husband's so yeah so that's it, that's pretty much it. That's my shower. So I'm gonna give you an overview. So it looks like this. So that's it for me today, girls. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe and I'm gonna see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Ciao.